guys, how you doing? So I've literally just finished the uh, the update to the COVID-19, literally just now. So I thought what I would do is, like I said, on those, I would actually start to do a pick a pile. It's the same as pick a card. Okay, I've shuffled the deck and we've put them into three different piles and I'll see if I can also channel any messages through the pile that you may pick. Okay, so I'm really not sure how people do this because I've never done it before. Okay, so just pick a pile from now of a one, two or three, keep it in your mind and actually try to relate to the story when it's told, but don't change your mind. Don't think, okay, well I picked a pile, but I wish I picked pile two, okay? So you can still watch them, but basically just pick a pile, okay? Keep it in mind, even write it down. They're saying something to do with like, write it down, writing. Writing, writing and writing, ranting, ranting about something, okay? Uh, so also, I don't know that uh, if any of you have seen, but when I said through uh, readings, I said it's in a van, it's in a van, like, and I kept saying van or van housing or van or vanning or vanity, okay? Van came up in my readings of definitely what's happened within this coronavirus is where it was going on in a van. Okay, so there's something that's going on in a van, okay? Um, or a van, the name of van, 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 I keep hearing van, 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 ran, 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 ran. Someone ran, someone ran out of time, is what they're saying. Somebody, some, you was giving someone time, okay, for a lot of you. And they're saying that you were giving it time, but someone ran, like they ran out of time. It's like, oh, you was running out of time. So I don't know if anyone was kind of like, make haste because you're running out of time. There's an urgency of something of where I feel like I'm running out of time. So if any of you feel like you're running out of time, I don't know, I'm picking up that some people have grandmas and grandpa, because I'm hearing grandpapa, grandpapa or mama but someone that calls someone mama or papa, okay? And if you do, I don't know why they're saying that someone feels like that they're actually running out of time, okay? So uh, keep that in mind. Keep all channel messages if they are. They will li literally only relate to the people that they're going to relate to, okay? But if you have grandparents, okay, and you know of something where there's an, an urgency of running out of time, I think that there's this way you want to go and see them, okay now that you want to go to see them because you feel like they're running out of time okay <coughs> i don't know why i'm picking up on muse of running out of time so i don't know what's going to be coming up but we are looking at pick a pile for uh the rest of june okay uh so we'll come out of the channel messages so okay so you picked a pile <coughs> excuse me still trying to stop smoking okay so we'll go with pile one okay Pile. I'm also hearing piles, <laughs> piles, parcels, parcels, parsons. Again, that came up through just me channeling through slightly through the coronavirus reading. Parsons, parsons, and parsons, and parsons, parcels. Loads of parcels being delivered. It's a little bit like what you know, Prime. Okay, so we're looking at pile one. But you know, when you order Prime and you have a, um, you can join. I think I haven't joined it, but you can join and you pay so much, but you have to order so many things within that time to get all of the worth of what it is. There's something that's to do with Prime, okay? Prime time, they're saying there's a lot to do with Prime time and a lot of to do with parcels and ordering a lot of things, like auditing, labeling, and sending them off or receiving them. Okay, whatever it is, I think that you're very interested in certain products that you want to uh, produce as like a production line, because I'm hearing like productions and production line. I'm also hearing Leos. So there's a lot of Leo energy in this. Well, I'm going extremely cold. So I've never tried channeling through these. So production line, also a lion, 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 lion. Some are really in a difficult situation with an actual Leo, and it could be to do with like lying in court, or it is to do with like parcels, that a lion is bought you a parcel. I'm also hearing Gemini, okay? Uh, parcels like parcels it could be it could be okay so I'm hearing the cross comparison of Leo and Gemini okay now I do know that it's Gemini's birthday or coming up I'm sure it is is that June or July I can't really remember I'm not gonna, <laughs> well I'm a tarot card reader I, I, I can't remember but June or July okay so I'm hearing parcels I'm also hearing birthdays and things being delivered and someone accepting a gift okay Someone that also has a gift very much, very present of a gift that is a little bit like this, spiritual gift, okay? Because I'm definitely hearing like the, the old saying of a quote of like present, on the, you open the present in order for the past and the past and the present. And I forget the, the complete notion of the quote, but you know what I'm saying? In order to unwrap the present gift is a gift of life for the future. So I'm hearing that kind of thing. 
is that someone knows how to live presently, okay? And it's a lot to do with the, the present self where the universe literally just provides for you. It provides everything for you that you're supposed to have. So, and like I've always said in life, it always comes out of directions that you least expect. As long as you answer your calling, your calling will answer you, but within time. All callings are answers and everything is going to be answered. So this parcel that's going to be delivered, there's going to be an answer in the parcel that you've got, okay? Parcel. So some of you, you could have been going through what I've gone through, which is that you're receiving a parcel. Could, like I said, it could be to do with like this, okay? Um, and you might be receiving a parcel and they're saying that you're going to have good news. So I don't know where the emergency muse thing was coming from. So I don't know if that was for a different pile, okay? Um, but definitely answering a calling of a gift that is going to be shown to you and is given to you. Also ordering a lot of parcels and, and using it as a speculation of accumulating to a speculate. There's a lot of speculation or so they're saying. Opticals, optical, optical illusion, they're saying an optical optician also some of you could be dealing with someone with eyesight problems okay um or you might be getting eyesight problems but optical op, op, uh, optician optician an optician they're saying an optician optitrack opti <laughs> that's a digitech but you might be interested in an optitrack that's a lot more expensive trust me um but uh same company um optitrack opt oct, 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 doctor 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 some do have a doctor doctor track doc 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 like sitting, sitting on the dock of the bay. Yeah, sitting on the dock of the bay. Or uh, the name uh, Ab Abby, Abby, I'm picking up Abby in some form or manner. A-B-B, -B, A -B, B A B B positive. Some of you have got a blood group of A, uh, oh, I can't remember blood groups, but is there an A-B-B -B positive? I don't know, A-B positive? Some of you have A-B positive or Abby positive. Or Abby positive. Someone is called Abby and they're very positive. Okay, or they've got positive, uh, okay. Positive. Ooh. So if you've got news and it's come back positive, then that's not good news, right? So I don't know. For some of you, it's like you've got news back from some sort of blood work and it's positive. But for some of you, which I don't want to put the freaks at people, because I have freak show for some reason. I don't know why. Like a show. Like, a, like I'm just going to show everybody. <laughs> I've got to show and tell everybody. So there is good news. So I think that, sorry. So sorry, I put the jeepers up. Yep. Yeah. Um, but there's positive news in this, positive news in this. Okay, so we're going to stop channeling. So let's see. So your story unfold for pile one is, first is the Knight of Pentacles. So whatever it is, it's going very slow. There's a plan. This is the Trojan horse, Trojans, Tro, 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 Trojan. Some of a Taurus, maybe, okay? So you've got Libra. So the decision is yours. Come on down. There's a decision. This could be a new person where things are not going very well. They're not, sorry, but they're not going very well, uh, very well. Something is not going very well for somebody. It's going very slowly. Someone's expectations of something that they wanted quicker isn't going as quick as, as they possibly wanted. Now, this could either be good news or bad news. If there is someone on the outset, this could be a brother or sister or so that has uh, someone that has Libra in their chart, okay, or a son even. But it just seems to be, they just seem to be moving forward very slow. I, I pick up that some of you, you've got a family situation okay, around any star sign here, uh, and, there, and there's something, some altercation in their life that is leading itself to being very slow. It's, it's, you might get in a, a work discussion with this person and say, look, will you just move it? Will you just, just do something and get going a bit faster? We've got so much to do. We've got so many products in order to do that we need you to, we need you to like, you know, put a pep in your step and get moving. So there's some, something as well around love of where someone's saying, this is really not going as fast as what I wanted. You know, I want an answer and I really want things to happen now, but unfortunately they can't. Okay, so you've got Libra there. So you've got Six of Swords, so it's definitely going on in the family. Someone really does want to go forward on with someone here, but they don't really want to go forward with this person here. You see, this person is pretty much like Elvis. It's like, well, I'm just about to leave the building, so the decision's up to yours. Do you want me to stay or do you want me to go? What is it that you want me to do? Or you could just literally have a child here that is at home here. Okay, but for love life wise, this might be the fact that this person is kind of like, you know what, I really want to go and I want to be with you. But if you don't want to be with me, I need an answer because it isn't going quite as far as what I wanted it to or it's not going as quick as what I wanted. Okay, so this person is thinking and they are contemplating on 
leaving, okay, they are thinking of leaving, just kind of like drop it, just, you know, will you just leave it and will you drop it? You know, let's just forgive, forget and just drop it. But if this is a lot to do with a love life, this person is asking the Libra, as if say, look, do you want to go forward with me? Do you want to be with me? What, you know, what do we do? But you could be in a relationship here, okay, and that you're just kind of in a circumstance that you can't really get out of at the moment. Okay, so you see, five of cups. Again, someone is, there's a, there is energy of third party here because someone feels down about, and it can be this person, of realising that it's not going as quick or as far as what they wanted it to with a Libra, okay? And because of that it isn't going as quick as what they wanted, that this person now feels shunned out or pushed out, the fact that it isn't going according to what this person wanted, okay? So they want more. So they want more time. Well, the, the, the Libra wants more time. The, any other sign could well be a Taurus to do with the marriage, wants it to go a bit quicker they want the job also if you're like because you would work for a libra generally okay um and uh they want things to happen a bit quicker they want answers a bit quicker they want work to pick up a bit quicker than what it is it just seems to be contracts at work seem to be going okay but just sort of slow but there is someone in the family that doesn't pull their weight if you have someone in the family that work for you and you're a Libra, okay, or you're a boss and you're the Libra, there's someone that doesn't move very quick and you're kind of like, man, you, you need to start pulling your weight and helping out because there's someone that they want help, but they don't give enough help towards the company in order to make it successful, okay? So someone feels like, you know, down in the dumps about... Uh, something okay so again they're not accepting so there is a third party here for a lot of you in this okay but it would definitely be involving a libra for 100 percent okay um but again five and four is nine so you've got a needing energy of codependency there for sure okay someone needs a lot of attention they need a lot of support but are they willing to open up in order to really be able to to get it you know because someone, people close down in life for a, uh, for a reason of why they close down. That everybody shuts down emotionally for a reason, right? That reason is told to them, but it's not told to the other person of why this person is, is in denial and not accepting it. Now, anything can happen to a four, and is the reason why they don't accept an offer, is because literally what they do want is leaving alone and having time in order to be able to give it, you know, to, to be able to get used to, the, used to something, used to... Mm. I used to, I just heard that I used you, mm -hmm. I used you for something, someone felt like that they used them, they used them for like, well you can do this for me, and obviously you can do things in life, and you can give me certain things, but the other person that wasn't accepted in this, felt used and abused, that the energy wasn't strong enough with one of these characters, that there was enough to keep this spark alive, and that it was going way too slow, and now someone feels, I just heard clinically depressed, but that is still the dark night of the soul, because this person could be an Aquarian, okay, because it's nine, and the nine of cups to me is uh, a fixed emotional sign, okay. So there's an Aquarius here, Aquarius, okay. Sorry, but I've got to put my greatest... My greatest um, <laughs> uh, fan. But um, again, I was your greatest fan and now you let me down. You know, I was there to support you. I was there to offer you a relationship and I felt like that you were my everything but you don't accept it. And because you don't, now I really want to leave but I really feel like I can't. Okay? So that's pile one. So let's look at pile two, okay? So the people that said pile two in their mind, let's go on with this pile. Okay, so you've got Libra again here. Things that are hidden from this same group here that can be watching it for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Okay, there are a lot of things that are not disclosed because someone shuts down for a reason they don't want to speak. The only way you ever get to learn what your intuition is is by not talking to people. Because people that are in it normally is when life becomes very confusing because you have people to deal with. You have energy to deal with. It's not normally physically possible for normal human beings, but for definitely for people that are spiritual and that are open, life can become very difficult when people want and need certain things from you in life 
towards your karma of where you close down and don't want to talk okay so this is an energy of force of trying to a force to be reckoned with of where I need time I need time okay I need time so you've got Taurus energy here and Scorpio Taurus Scorpio oh, sorry I didn't channel any messages through here did I okay um, mm, let's see let's see oh, I can't now the cards are out because it interferes with the, interfering see interfering that's what they're saying someone's interfering with the connection between you guys um, interference interference I keep picking up Sophie, so Sophie I'm picking up the name Sophie or sofa um, but it feels like a, a lounger lounger lou scrounger sorry that's what I'm hearing a scrounger someone that's asking for a lot of attention from someone that doesn't want to give it and it's coming across as like a needing energy of uh, I need things from you but I'm emotionally this person here is emotionally blocked they don't want something in their life they're trying to save money yeah I can't hear anything <laughs> I can't hear anything this person also doesn't want to hear it they don't want to hear it they are literally in that aspect of like you know what I don't want to hear it I really do not want to hear it you know don't ask me don't say anything I don't want to hear it I've heard it all before if I've heard it before that's the reason why I'm closed down because I've heard it all before this is a little bit like where you've gone through such a cycle with someone that everybody's closing down shops everything people they're all shut off closed off blocked no the answer is no you know so again money wise is good because you're focused and driven but this person may be seen in society that all they care about is themselves but to the other person they're seeing it as like well all you ever think about is yourself anyway so if you're closing down so am i you know speak it's kind of an energy of like speak when spoke to you know i don't want to speak to you i can speak to you when you don't rant and rave because obviously there's a ranting and raving here that's probably where the first message came from before the cards is ranting and raving like you, you you just absolutely just lost the plot and that's the reason why i shut down because people will close down for a reason you know so there's a lot of like well the opportunity was there and i give it to you but then we arrived at two and that opportunity was missed because you you, you didn't say anything you know you missed the boat in a way it's a little bit like the gravy train you missed the you missed the gravy train you missed the gravy train but again someone doesn't want it you know they don't want it they really don't they don't want the drama in their life they really they, you know they really don't they really don't because again virgo here so you got virgos okay virgos i really did struggle yesterday doing your reading for july okay there was a lot of confusing energy for me to really get going with the channel so you'll see those when they come out if you're virgos you'll see when they come out of how those channel messages started to get bigger but there, there's uh, an air of like you know what you <laughs> this is clinical depression and or it can be a clinical illness that someone has like a, a depression or an illness of um i don't know they're constantly in the shadows in the shadows oh wow well, sorry that just took my breath away <laughs> did it just took my breath away someone takes someone's breath away from them right their breath it's like I can't breathe this person can't breathe properly meaning that there's so much that's gone on in this person's life that they can't breathe properly and all breathe like they lose breath or they leave people breathless meaning like mm, breast I'm also hearing breasts someone probably has a nice a rack <laughs> someone prize probably a prize prize like a prize winner someone sees someone as like a prize winner it's like you're my prize winner you're everything that I want, everything that I need, but there's no getting through to you. There is poss no possible way that I can get through this energy. There is someone that is suffering through such depression here that they can't see their way out of it. This is also in a relationship of the blind leading the blind. It really is, because someone is going off pure blind faith, but the faith is, is that someone's saying, you've got to have faith, and they're like, I don't know if I can. I really don't know if I can ever see my way out of this pattern that is just constantly going on constantly because this person is shutting everybody out there's Scorpio energy here from here as well which is right you can't prize or prize anything out of a Scorpio I'll give you a good advice 
If you know Scorpios, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, definitely, definitely rising, okay? Well, Scorpio in general, you cannot prize information of feelings that they're attached to themselves. You can't prize for information because they won't give it. They will shut down. But that's any star sign, really. But someone is so obsessed with getting information about someone. The reason why they're shutting down is because they do have strong placements of Taurus and Scorpio, right? And that's why they're closed down. That's why they're shut down, because people are trying to get in. So there's a lot of devastation that's gone on over the predictions where I said about the breakings and the riots. This is that as well. Is, is that if, and I said this through the Virgo reading, I think, <clears throat> if there was a shop, would you break into it to take what's in it? Because I would really hope that the majority of people would say no. Okay, the majority. If there was a pub, would you break in it and steal all their money and take all of their products that are in this thing? Because there was something stolen from this person. Okay. okay, guys, so sorry about that. That was actually the door that was picking up the parcel for um, for the other coronavirus thing. Okay, so um, yeah, so what I was saying is, is that you wouldn't break into a pub, you wouldn't break into a shop, and you wouldn't take all of their goods and their items of everything. And this could possibly, what I'm channeling, that happen with this person, is, is that goods were taken... Things were taken from this person, Goods, Goodman, I'm also hearing Goodwin, Goodwin or Goodman, the name Goodman or Goodwin, okay, a good win. This person probably had a very good win and a windfall and they're protecting everything that they've got, their assets, their money, they're probably looking for an insurance claim, they could well have had that. There was a windfall, okay, someone could have also had a fall, there could be a Pisces energy, there could have been a journey also, but there could have been like a windfall that this person's got. They seem to have everything that they want, everything that they need, but there's someone that can't get through to them, okay, in their family or in their love situation. They can't possibly get through. Now, what I was saying is, is through this breaking in is that you wouldn't hopefully do all of these kind of things, so why on earth would people think that? that you can break into someone's head and get through to their mind of when they don't want to communicate. Because if someone shuts down emotionally and someone doesn't want it, okay, the last thing that you ever do is apply force and pressure with someone because they just don't react with pressure. This person doesn't like to be under pressure. And when they do is when people probably don't get on in this energy, which is Libra and Virgo. Okay? And I'm definitely hearing that obviously these things in life that you wouldn't do, but when it comes to information, Information is power and key to a knowledge of why we have connections with people of why they are denied. Okay, so there's a lot of denial in this energy of where people are going through it because someone is forcing pressure on somebody to speak when they don't want to, which is speak when spoken to, meaning I can speak to you when I'm okay, but if I'm not, don't ask. Okay, and because someone was asking, that's generally now because why they did. Sorry, I just thought I had the door again. I really don't know if it did. Um, because of that, that is now why this person's closed down, okay? But there could have been a lot of breaking in and stuff like that. Again, you see, money. This person is focused and driven so much on money as well. They really are, right? They are... You see, this is what I say in life. You can't base your energy off other people and you can't base your energy off someone else because someone else, right? I think that there is someone else in this energy. I don't know. If it isn't someone else, or the other someone else is their family member, okay, or their job, and someone poss possibly starts to see that your job is kind of in the way of this connection, or your parent is in the way of this connection, and that you have so much money, <laughs> I mean, there is someone here that could well have a lot of money, okay, but they're saving it. This person is is very respectful of their own career and their own life of what they want to do here. This person could be very successful. This is a true accountant or bank of someone that banks on a lot of things of their life, of what they love in life, okay, what they love in life. And that doesn't mean that this person doesn't love you, but again, you've got Scorpio Taurus energy here. And getting those energies of masculines, I mean, I don't know about feminine energies, but masculine energies of those, they would definitely really not be throwing the love around the, the love word around very very sporadically and giving it over just like you know just say it you know this person loves their work and they love their career but there's definitely something going on in their family that brings a lot of things to their attention of depression okay 
Um, but if you look at possible here within the love life between Virgo and Libra, Taurus, Scorpio, this person's very dedicated towards making it towards their career, but it's very difficult for someone to prize any kind of like the amount of feelings that I want. If I really want it really quickly and I really want this and I really want it, if there's an urgency, there's pressure. And if there's pressure, there's an emergency. Okay, so there could be a, a depression of, of any kind of emergency going on, but there could be like someone so urgent, okay, that they want something very fast that the other person's kind of like, it's on my terms. It is only on my terms. Okay, so you definitely got big Libra energy here. On one hand, I've got my I've got my work, I've got my love, I've got I've got my love. My love, I've got my love. So you've got cycle. It is a cycle. It's pretty much here that there could well be there could well be another person in this energy. I'm gonna try and not look for that though. Four, five, six. Okay. Is is that someone is they work for the public eye. They they spend a lot of time in the public eye. They spend a lot of time on what they work for in life. Okay, and it might be seen to other people that they just don't have time for a relationship. But really, when everybody says about conditional and tr traditional values and everything else, you tell me what a traditional value is, especially when you're spiritual. Is everybody really supposed to be following this protocol of that we're supposed to live together, have children, get married, live ever, ever, ever after? No. You know, relationships, they are completely different when you're in them compared to when you're not. Okay. So there's a lot of. Uh, I, want, I really want to make it. This person is so determined here to, to be successful in life, okay, that they're dedicated towards their life, but there could be a possible meet-up with this person. Let's see. Sorry, I know you've got more cards here. Scorpio, Taurus, Energy, Four of Swords. This person is taking a break. So you might be able to... I don't know. Them, I'm, I don't know why I'm picking up, but you might be able to take a break together. Or you're on a break. You, you could well be in this energy of where you're sort of on a break, right? I don't, some of you, you're not talking to this person at all. You're not talking to this person, right? Some of you, you kind of are talking, right? And you're just on a break, mid break. This is also school holidays and break, like having a break. It's like, I need a break. I'm just out. I like, like. This is that Scorpio energy Taurus where I'd said in their reading is uh, everybody out. <laughs> right everybody out if you interfere everybody's out i'm shutting down i'm closing down out i really am picking up like a break-in here like a shop or something that got broke into and someone's like you know what everybody out get out like get out <clears throat> I, I am hearing an argument here like get out of my head get out it's all i can hear get out 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 someone could well have gout for some reason or doubt Someone is self-doubting, doubting, and also gout, which is a, a, a obviously like something. Well, you know what gout is, right? Um, gout. I'm also hearing doubt, 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 doubt. I very much doubt it. I very much doubt that there's ever going to be any. This doesn't have to be a love life though. This can really be anybody that you know that's been trying to get in information and like I, I need it, 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 and you're like, bruv out, get out. <laughs> I'm getting angry uh, again. So because of that. I very much doubt that there's ever going to be any true amount of uh, reconciliation with this person at all, of the person that has been forcing and forcing and forcing and forcing and forcing, that is relating itself to control. It always relates to control and narcissism. It doesn't have to be narcissist. It can if you know one, right? But we break through control issues. But if someone keeps doing it, <clears throat> then you know that they're turning from control to narcissism. Right, because you, you can get lost in like, well, do they just have control issues that they're getting through, or are they a complete narcissist? Right, so you have to kind of like know your own circumstance. But that is definitely here of someone really trying to find out information about someone, of them saying, stop asking, <laughs> stop asking, don't ask. Okay, so pile that's pile two, but you can also look for the star signs. Okay, pile three, <coughs> pile three. Teresa, I'm hearing the name Teresa, also green. Trees are green. What do you know? They are trees are green. Green, green, the green, green, green grass. Green, 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 green. Doreen, also I'm hearing Doreen. 
Dring, dring. I'm hearing dring, 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 dring. Phone. Hello. <laughs> Hello, that's the phone. <laughs> the phone. Your phone is going to ring. You probably work for a phone company. You probably do this at work where you answer the phone quite a lot. Okay. Uh, but this is, uh, I'm also hearing Elliot also, which is uh, ET, phone home, home phone, phoning home. Someone wants to phone home or it's go, or this foam. I'm seeing foam, not a foam, hopefully it's not a foam party that you're going to. I'm hearing a foam party, phone party. Like, you know these apps and stuff, I don't do that. But on Facebook, where there's like a party, okay, there might be a, a party that's going on somewhere. A physical, like, hey, there's a party, bruv. But like a, a an app party where you're like, oh, well, hold on, there's Doreen. All right, uh, Fred, oh, you want to come in, dear? Like, oh, you went in on this, okay, oh, you want in on it too? There's, and you all join in a, like a face group chat thing. But I'm picking up like someone wants in on something. Like, oh, I want a piece of that. Like, I want in on that. Someone is kind of like, they've really got their eye on a new person in this pile. So this is kind of going on for the people that are after someone new. This is kind of like, oh, I want a piece of that. There's there's someone that is also suffering through uh, a diet as well, pretty much like me. I'm really trying again still. Uh, but like, oh, I'll have a piece of that. It's like, I'll have a piece of that. I'll have a piece of that. I'll have... That came out for a reading. Wow. Through the readings for July. Keep an eye out. Uh, I'll have a piece of that. I'll have a piece of that too. Oh, somebody wants a piece of pie. Pregnancy. Pregnancy. Definitely in this pile. That came up for people. Please please make sure that you hit the bell and look out for the next lot of month readings that come out. Uh, pregnancy. Someone's due. Someone's due and is eating a lot of cake. Someone is having their cake and eating it also in the relationship. Some people. They're seen as having their cake and eat it, meaning I want the whole piece. Someone wants the whole piece of the pie here. Someone wants everything. Someone also, there was some funky stuff going down as well. Some funky stuff. Uh, like Funk Nation, I'm also hearing. Trap Nation, also the stuff that I've been putting out. Trap Nation, I'm also hearing the nation. The nation, uh, nationwide also. Bank account, Taurus is also in here. Uh, to um, Tory, the Tory party is also here. <laughs> Tory, whoa. Oh, the name Toya. Toya Wilcox, also someone listens to Toya Wilcox. Um, uh, what else have we got? Toy, 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 toy. I know I'm hearing toy. Hello, toy. Uh, wow, I did pick up on uh, energies as well around that. There was Chinese, some do of Chinese. Okay, so it's either food or someone that is from China or, or, or some kind of ethnic, uh, other than, you know. but uh, yeah, I'm hearing toy, 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 like a new toy. Because like, oh, a new toy. <laughs> that's me. <laughs> like, oh, cool, that's a new toy. Someone's also got phallic toys, okay? So someone has definitely got phallic toys, okay? So you might need some new batteries for that one, okay? But definitely toys, like, oh, that's a new toy. It's like, oh, I want that. It's pretty much like a lot like what I am around music. It's like, cool, look at that shiny thing. Cool, I want that new toy. Or a toy Toyota, also a car, motor. So something to a Cancerian as well is in here. Um, Toyota, toy, I was like, all right, Bob, you got a new motor? Uh, toy, 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 I keep hearing toy, 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 it's all they keep saying, toy, 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 it's like uh, the gold member, it's like, oh, there's toys, <laughs> someone is tight, also tight fisted, maybe, okay, I don't see anything wrong in being tight fisted, if you earn it, it's yours, keep it, bruv, right, but someone's seen as being tight fisted, meaning, uh, I don't know, it's, it's, <laughs> I don't know, but again, someone seems like tight, 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 tight. T what on earth are you on about, spirit? Tighting, tightens, 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 tightens. I don't know whether like something's getting tighter and tighter and tighter. Like my belt is getting tighter and tighter. I'm really picking up someone that is, or Thai, Thailand, from Thailand or Thai. Someone's from Thai. Kai. I'm also hearing Kai, Kai, Kylie or Kai. Akai, Akai, Akaka, Akaka. <laughs> so that definitely came out for a Taurus reading. It was Taurus. Kaka, Kaka, ta 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 ta, ta ta. It's like ta. Thank you, ta 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 ka ta. Okay. Ta. <laughs> so uh, I don't know because um, I'm hearing um, a car, like a car, a car, a car, a uh, Carmen or car, like Cancerian car. But you're like, ka 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 ka
Someone, because he was a uh, bell servant. He's like, ding, Manuel, care, care. <laughs> I don't know why I'm thinking of that. Like papers or something being served. And it's like, okay, yeah, I'm here. I don't know. Because, I mean, I, 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 there's certain people that live, obviously, in different parts of the world. And, um, because I heard Runaway Bride or, or something. Now, Oh, I'm not going to go into all of that because I don't know how to pronounce it and say it, and because um, I, I I can't remember the language and where the we're going to leave it. So we're going to leave it there. So anyway, so I'm hearing those very strange noises coming from here. There's a noise that's coming from here, making a noise. Like I want to make a noise. It's like I really want to make noise and just noise, 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 nose, 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 nose. Never cut your nose off to spite a face. Libra, you are also... Wow, Libras, you are everywhere and nowhere, baby. There's... Never cut your nose off to spite your face. Pride. Leo. Okay, there's a same-sex relationship in this energy here. I'm not saying pride. Pride is obviously like gay pride, okay? But also pride of seven, which was never cut your nose off to spite your face. So if you've ever watched seven... You'll realise why I ended up... Um, I think I'm going to change it back to calling it Seven, like it used to be. Seven Tarot. It, oh, it just doesn't sit with me. It sounds very weird. But, uh, yeah, Seven, my life path, of why I created Seven, right? Um, but never cut your nose off to spite your face of anything that's beauty or in the eyes of the beholder. There's something about that it's in the beholder, 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 hold, behold... Holden, Holden, hold Amanda Holden. Oh, are you watching Amanda? <laughs> Amanda Holden, Amanda Holden. Okay, so Amanda Holden was in um, the the singing thing. This is a lot to do with music in here. The singing thing. Amanda Holden was with uh, him. That used to wear his trousers. Uh, what's his name? Oh, anyway, that's got to be the worst performance, or that's got to be the best performance we've had all season. Cal, <laughs> Cal, uh, what's his name? Jeremy, Car not Jeremy Carl. Wow, that's a <laughs> get out. <laughs> that's, Jer that's Jeremy Carl. Get out, go on, go. Um, what's his name? Cal, Simon, Simon. What's Harry hearing? Simon says a guessing game as well, but like um, Kyle, Jeremy, Simon, Cal. When they do the production and they come on and say, "Hey, that's a great show." What do you know? Hip hip. So anyway, yeah, that one. So performing arts, something is in this pile. Okay, so let's see. Really? Scorpio. <laughs> the death card. So something, something so strong. Something is so strong, there could be a pong in the air. I, I, I am definitely hearing, I don't, sorry for being ignorant, but I'm hearing Chinese. I am, okay. Something is wrong. Something is wrong. Well, two wrongs don't make a right, okay? Two wrongs don't make a right. There's something like, I need to make it right. I just need to make it right. I just need to make it right. This is an obsession just like me. I do have Scorpio rising. Yes. It's like, I just need to make it right. I just need to make it right. I've just got to keep doing it. And I'm obsessed about this thing. I've just got to make it right. I just need to make it happen. And I've got to make it right. It's got to be perfect. It's got to be. It's got to be perfect. Yes. Perfect. I am chiseling myself of perfection. Marcel. I'm always saying Marcel. Marcel. Or Marsha, 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 or Marshall, Marshalls. Some of you might be into guitar or Marshall, or you're like uh, the product Marshalls, okay? Or partial. It's like, oh, I'm very partial to a piece of that. Someone's very partial. Or parcel, again, same kind of energies of what I was channeling, though, through parcels, parcels and parcels and parcels. <laughs> it's probably me <laughs> in this one. But um, again, this is very esoteric, right? Eight's the most esoteric, is, is, just is. Because this is you're in alignment. Whatever it is that you're doing, you're in alignment with your assignment of what you're supposed to be doing and written for you in life. So you're supposed to be doing it. So where it is that you're building and building and creating and creating and you're trying to make something perfect. Whatever it is, it's perfection, it's performing an arts and it's perfecting itself because of dedication of like, I am obsessed about this thing and it just keeps me going it just keeps me going. It's like, I've just got to keep going. I've got to keep going. I've got to keep going. I've got to keep going. Okay. There you go. The sun. The sun. Leo. Here. The family are here. There is also possible that there could have been a death in the family. Okay. There could have been. That could have been slight. I'm picking up. 
So, I don't know. That's not for everybody. I'm picking up Reese. The name Reese. Okay. Uh, Reese or Rihanna. 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 The name Re oh, Rihanna. The actual artist Rihanna. You won't be watching this, Rihanna. <laughs> right? But Rihanna. <coughs> or Anna. The name Annie. Annie or Nanny. It could be a nanny. Some of you could work in the care field as a nanny and it's around children or like a care facility thing. And you could see a lot of that kind of stuff going on. Okay? Uh, or a nanny. Because I'm hearing neen, neen or nine. Nine, like nine. Someone could be... <laughs> wow, we're hearing like different places. Okay, but nine. Um, get down! <laughs> but, but anyway, there's... Uh, there's a lot of esoteric wisdom, for sure. There's growth. This is transformation, 100%. 100% this person is transforming things in their life. This is someone that liked products to transform it. Okay, like transformers also, like, you know, actual transformer. But like, uh, transcending also, but transformance, a performance arts. This is arts as well, performing arts. This is perfecting my life, performing my art, so let's perfect our lives. A moment of magic. A moment of magic. Give us an hour of magic. Give us an hour of greed. <laughs> Give us an hour of magic. Give us the purple glove. Jim Morrison. Wow. So, king. Wow, this is the king. <laughs> You've got everything in this one. Water sign. Leo. Water signs. Cancer. Scorpio. Pisces. Leo. Okay. So, Something is oh so wrong with a family member though. This is oh so strong, but oh so wrong is what I heard. Something is wrong. This is two wrongs don't make a right. That's what I'm saying. Someone's always right, someone's always wrong. There's a negative energy that is coming through that someone has like a Libra placement here. Okay, which could be moon or rising or Venus, but I'm picking up more to do with like somewhere that's a non-compatible part of that of oh so wrong okay someone is all in the family is doing someone wrong is doing someone harm in this connection is what i'm feeling because they're all standing right in the way work gets in the way sure but there is someone at home the hierophant is here hierophant means work it also means content, uh, traditional values it also means parents and jobs okay and home okay so there's always somebody at home or at work that is standing in the way of this. Now, if you work from home or you wherever you work, there is someone that's always standing in the way of you being able to go forward. And you're kind of like, what? Like, what? You're kind of like, you know what? Keep it out. Everybody out. I'm here. Great energy. The sun, the king of cups, the work. Okay. So great energy. So, but there is something wrong here, okay? Yeah, this person leaves you confused here. Like I said, there is a Libra energy somewhere, okay? But someone's doing someone, keeping them always at a crossroads. This is kind of like putting a little bit of spice into things though. This is kind of like, you always leave me hanging. Like, there's always more. There's always more for that I can do. There's always more out there for me. I just need to like continue on up this path, okay? Because you're standing at a crossroads now of a decision that needs to be made. And if that Libra energy is here, I can't tell you star signs apart from Leo, Scorpio, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, okay? But again, decision. Oh dear. Seven or so. But again, someone will get offended and defended. Again, like I said, there is someone in this energy here to cause conflict. Five. Which is like, well, I'm just standing here waiting for you to make a decision from this state of mind. So I said, never talk to people in this kind of state. Okay, when you're in this kind of state and it ruminates an estate, I'm also picking up like an estate, estate agent. Or an estate of a house, a home. Okay? So, whenever you're in that state of mind, don't talk to the person to project five onto them. Okay? Because you always come from projection of where, when you talk with people, 
here. Because this can be play fighting. That someone wants attention. And this is a bit like going up to someone and kind of like, I'm just going to do this just to get your attention. But if they're doing it manipulatively, there's an energy of that being there. Okay, one more card. It's happening to a child as well. It could be a younger person. Sort of saying, this could well be in the family. Okay. Um, let's see. But love life, very good. But someone does get cut out. This is out. Out, 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 out. I don't care what you do, what you say. The answer is no, I don't want reconciliation. Don't even try. Don't even try. But I, I can't clarify these. But I'm really picking that up esoterically. You're just going to have to believe me. If I was to do the full reading, it would. I, I think that it really would come up with that. Because this here is someone that's causing a lot of conflict. Okay, not saying it's Scorpio. Could be happening two, four against. Not really bothered. You're going to have to pick. Okay, but again, there's conflict there. When I say I'm not bothered, because I'm bothered about people, what I'm saying is, is that, you know, it's general reading. But uh, you'll have to pick who you're at most conflict with because family's here, you see, family. So it could well be going in the family and it runs through the family, this conflict. It just doesn't help. It doesn't help the relationship and it doesn't help the being able to work from home. A lot of you here, you could well work from home, but you just have a lot of conflict around either one, your partner or two, your mother or father or someone that you're living with. And it just makes it very difficult to be able to try and avoid this person because they might want to know about your love life and stuff here, okay? Because they constantly want to reconcile and talk, but they want to talk from this state of mind, you see? And so I say, don't ever, don't ever talk to this person from a state of mind because literally all they will do is blame you here. They will tell you that it's your fault, more likely. And then you'll get into a two and eight of telling them that, no, it's you. No, 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 it's you. No, it's you. I told you that it's you. And again, you start to go out of control, you know? So when you mind your own business, if someone really tries to get into someone's head, that's because they're causing conflict to try and cause something. Cause and effect. Don't be affected. Someone could also have an affection or so. Affection. <coughs> Infection or affection. Want some affection. <laughs> someone wants some loving and affection. Okay. So this could well be teasing and play fighting. Someone just wants some affection, but they possibly can't have it. And it winds them up because you might be at social distancing here you might not be with your partner okay physically and it causes a lot of conflict because you can't see each other because these are pages sometimes they're not talking pages think they just don't speak they might speak to one another but that can also mean that it's not it's not actual physically moving that would be a night this is that so what i'm picking up that you might be at a social distance from this person and that it just causes a bit of drama because what you want to do is see the person but you just physically can't but you're still with them okay so it creates a chain of, of a bit like all I really want is some affection here. Okay, so that's your readings. Thanks very much, guys. That's the first time that I've ever just done pick a pile, pick a reading. Okay, um, so if you liked it, please let me know that you liked it and I'll probably hopefully try and make more. But now I've got to get on with everybody else's July. And then also, every, if you want to reach out for personal reading, you still can. Okay, um, but then I've got to do the 1st to the 15th and then the 15th to the 30th to put over on for tier two. So consider tier twos a lot of you because you will get your monthly and it will go to tier one and to tier two to tier to tier to tier to tier to tier to tier um but uh the rest of them they literally do and if you want to join now you obviously have access to everything that's been going on through june all of your predictions and everything that they're all over there okay so if you are do want to consider consider it consider me wow does anybody like alan stone alan stone <laughs> consider me what a great tune i love alan stone he is a great person he's also a pisces as well do you know <laughs> he is if you're watching now all right mate i'm a pisces but yeah uh alan stone i don't know if you like alan stone but he's saying psych uh circle what a brilliant track what that's one oh man that makes me go cool when he does circle that is such a good tune man isn't uh, he's done some great tunes he really has uh so if you don't know of alan stone please look it up on youtube Okay, and check Alan Stone. He's actually got a YouTube channel. He's been doing a lot of talking, okay, which is... <laughs> he, he's actually done quite a lot of stuff with, through the coronavirus of doing a lot of live shows, um, a lot of questions and answers. But uh, check out his music, man. You'll love it. It's great. Uh, so Alan Stone, all right? All right, guys. So uh, again, consider everything. Consider me. But consider everything. And uh, consider it. I'm also inconsiderate. Inconsiderate. Someone sees someone as inconsiderate. 
like an uh, inconsiderate, like you're just inconsiderate. Can't you take my apology? Again, someone is, they're trying to like apologize to someone, but they're like, you're so inconsiderate for not uh, like apologizing to me, or you're so inconsiderate for not accepting my apology. But that's with someone that you've got going on in the family of someone that you know that you don't really want to. Because this person constantly wants to reconcile a fight, meaning you have one, they want to reconcile. You have one, they want to reconcile. And you're kind of like, bruv, out, I'm done, no, I'm, it's done, it's over, I don't want to reconcile. So for a lot of you, there's good energy and bad energy around this reading here, okay? Reconciliation, no, yes, no, yes, which is coming across as slight control. It is, because it's just, it's, there's not many cards, but again, it is as a feeling. All right, guys, thanks very much. Cheers, see you soon.